Good morning, happy Monday, everybody. I hope everybody's ha uh, mm -hmm. Try it again. <laughs> I hope everybody had a great weekend, and we are going to start this week off with a positive thought in our head. Today is Monday. It is a great day. It's going to be an awesome week. What? What? Positive attitude. It's all you got to have to make it through today and the rest of the week. Really? I mean, don't don't make it so difficult. I know everybody does. <clears throat> so my question to you is, how are you using your mind today to make yourself feel great or not? That's a great question. Me, I got up this morning and I did my workouts. I did my Fit Girl workout. Technically, I'm really on week four because <clears throat> I started a week earlier with the workouts that they had posted. So I'm actually on the last week of my Fit Girl um, challenge. And today was day 15 of Morning Meltdown 100. And it was, uh, I, always, I always say it wrong, freestyle flow. So it was more about just getting into, <clears throat> getting into the week, in my personal opinion. It was great to start off the week with um, just flowing through, doing some eh, yoga poses, but not really, just more like stretching and just getting into your, your breath and um, finding yourself, if you will. So I found myself this morning, I found myself in my living room, <laughs> um, stretching, and it felt really, really good. Um, I know by, because see, I didn't finish this program last time just because I got sick and then I just didn't have the energy to keep going. <clears throat> I ended up on day 70, I think, is what my last day was. And uh, I was able to almost do the splits. And freestyle flow is the one where we have the time to like stay in the stretches a little bit longer. And I'm, I'm going to attempt by day 70 to be in the splits again. So I haven't, I mean, like real splits. Um, I was kind of like almost there, but my goal is by day 70 to be in an actual like split position. <laughs> I did that, I think the last time I did the splits, <clears throat> it's probably in elementary school. <laughs> it was a long time ago. Like, wow. I was like, oh, bad story or a bad, good memory, but weird. Um, I was in a private school for my first through fourth year of school and I was a cheerleader. <laughs> oh, uh, but it was, I think it was only for one season. And you know, when you're in a private school, you couldn't wear, I think we had to wear jeans. We had to wear a white <clears throat> long sleeve shirt buttoned up at the top with a little red bow and then a red t-shirt over the top. That was cheerleading way back when. Yeah, and I was the one who could do the splits back then. So here's my chance <laughs> to show myself up and say, I can do the splits again. Oh my gosh, what a memory. Isn't that weird how sometimes just things just <clears throat> blow your mind? I was a little cheerleader. <laughs> But then I got into public school and nobody liked me, so I wasn't a cheerleader anymore. So, whatever. <laughs> My life could have been so different if I was not traumatized as a child. I'm just kidding. Um, that's just too funny. Sorry. <clears throat> well, you are going to make up your mind this morning. You get up this morning and you think positive thoughts. Today is a great day. Today is just another day, and we're going to make it an awesome day, and we're going to make it a great week. Yes. Let's do this. Let's rock this. Let's have an awesome week. And by the way, Rock Steady's in Keokuk on Saturday at V's. If you don't have anything to do, great food, great service, and amazing live music on Saturday night from 9 to 1230. So I'll keep pitching that out through the week. I hope everybody has an awesome, fantastic day and a great week. Thank you so much for your love, support, and encouragement. You all are amazing. And don't do anything I wouldn't do.